Welcome back. The arc of discovery for this Leonard project is gonna start with achieving a stable sonoluminescence. So I've changed this reactor design quite a bit. You'll notice I've migrated from two horns inside of a straight pipe run to an actual top and bottom hemisphere. This is very similar to existing successful sonoluminescence reactors. Oftentimes they're in a glass sphere, but these are going to be aluminum top and bottom so we can machine them and control their shape and do some lensing on the shape of those surfaces. So you'll see here, we've got two hemispheres and a manifold in the center. The idea here is that the piezo transducers on top and bottom can be controlled and the wall thickness of the cavities of the hemispheres can be controlled. We can also put an optional stem top and bottom to put another little sort of acoustic focusing lens in there. Okay, so I think by having those capabilities, having a vent on top, still passing our nickel wire through it. By doing this, we'll be able to very carefully control what's going on with those pressure waves all collapsing in the center. To approach this like an engineer and not just completely trial and error, we really should be using some sort of CFD analysis on the standing waves in there. So I've stepped into a huge rabbit hole with open foam. If any of you out there know how to use open foam, I'd like to talk to you. All right, check it out. Let me know what you think in the comments. Thanks so much for following this project. I think it'll be really fun when it comes together. Adios.